And so some fish are deadly to dogs. So some dogs are deadly to dogs. <laughs> and so some fish are deadly to dogs. Welcome you all to our family, Lucy Miguel's Fairy Day. So today's video is about fish. If you have packet food se bol chuke ho and would love to try some home cooked food, then this is the right video for you. So know everything about fish. Yet another alternative protein source. Kya such me fish safe hai? Uh, yes, ha bilkul. Dogs can eat fish. Fish is an excellent source of protein. Rich in omega-3 fatty acids, just may health ki bohat sari benefits hai. And so, it is often included in commercial dog food as well. A fish is a very healthy source of protein, but some types of fish can cause serious illness. And so, we must always take care which parts and what types of fish can be safely eaten by dogs. When first time I thought to get Lucy fish, I was too scared. But fish is not at all harmful. But the way we prepare can cause problems. With the right method and right amount of portion, fish can be a good alternative to protein like chicken. Let's know the benefits first. Why it is a good alternative to chicken? What are the benefits? It contains higher omega-3 fatty acids, which is a natural source of anti-inflammatory, which helps body ki inflammation ko kam karne mein help karta hai. Beneficial for dogs suffering from arthritis or any joint problem. Again, like chicken, fish is also beneficial for dogs' fur, skin, heart, brain as it provides protein and also in minimizing food allergies. Yes, kuch dogs are allergic to kuch kisam ki food or dust. Se. So, fish is a type of protein that dogs with these allergies don't react to. Now, with benefits, there are some risks given. Kuch fish are very harmful for dogs ke liye and can increase the risk of mercury poisoning. And so, some fish are deadly to dogs. Now let's see which types of fish your dog can and cannot eat. These fish are larger and older and so cannot be eaten by dogs. Now guys, this information is according to Food Administration Guidelines. This detailed information in the description box. Mein de diya hai. You can go and check it out. Now, let's talk about which types of fish dogs can have. So, salmon, tilapia, white fish, catfish, cod, and many more. These are smaller, younger, and short lived. And less likely to have high mercury levels. I generally give them fish. Like tilapia, salmon. Before feeding these, fresh cod fish should be properly cleaned. Kuch fish ke parts bohat zyada painful ho sakte hain and cause serious injury. So jani kaun se fish ke parts hum bachcho ko de sakte hain? Bones, fins, head, tail and scale should not be included in your dog's diet as these can damage their internal organs. Okay, can give fish head because usme protein ke saath dusre important nutrients bhi hote hain. So can be given sometimes, kabhi kabhar. Fish bones are very small, very sharp and very dangerous to dogs. Fish bones are so sharp enough to puncture the stomach. This say unka digestive tract damage ya only internal bleeding bhi ho sakti hai. So guys, please before feeding, remove leftover bones. So which parts can be given? Cook fish skin through me. Uncooked fish skin is not at all safe. They carry harmful bacteria and parasites. Fish is definitely the safest choice. The American Veterinary Medical Association does not recommend consumption of raw or uncooked fish. So, fish should be properly cooked. Use achi tarike se cook kar lena shahi. Okay, there are some types of fish that contains thiaminase, which means that can be fed raw. But still, mujhe lagta hai, uncooked fish nahi dena shahi because it is hard to digest. Raw fish may harmful bacteria and parasites hote hai, which are very harmful to dogs and can make them sick. For this reason, any fish your dog eat should be properly cooked, but not the way we prepare it. Dogs should not eat fish with any seasoning or oil. Then fish kaise cook kare? Boiling, steaming, 
and grilling are some of the ways to cook fish. No fried fish at all. They can experience gastrointestinal issues. Just like vomiting or diarrhea may occur. You can give fish to children two ways. One, as an occasional treat. That means feed your kid very small portion, very small, a snack kind of thing. Fish should make only up to ten percent of their daily calories. And two, as a part of their home cooked diet. जैसे कि आप रेगुलर फूड देते हो इंक्लूडिंग विटामिन फाइबर्स कार्ब्स एटसेट्रा नाउ व्हाट एंड हाउ मच टू ऐड ऑल ऑफ दीज विटामिन मिनरल्स टू मेक अ परफेक्ट बैलेंस डाइट वी वर लर्न इन अ फर्दर वीडियोस सो अगर आप सबको ये वीडियो नहीं मिस करना है तो नीचे का ही नोटिफिकेशन बेल होगा प्रेस दैट बेल फॉर फर्दर वीडियो अपडेट्स नाउ प्लीज नोट गाइस इफ यू वांट टू ऐड फिश इन देयर बैलेंस डाइट प्लान रिमेंबर टू रिमूव स्मॉल अमाउंट ऑफ द एवरी डे फूड जैसे कि आप उन्हें अगर चिकन राइस दे रहे हो या एनी पैकेट फूड सो जस्ट रिप्लेस इट विद फिश विद द राइट अमाउंट जिससे उन्हें ओवर फीडिंग नहीं हो सो वट इज द राइट अमाउंट टू गिव ओके बिफोर प्रोसीडिंग विद द प्रपोर्शन अगर आप फर्स्ट टाइम फिश दे रहे हो दैन इंट्रोड्यूस देम इन अ स्मॉल अमाउंट एट अ टाइम जब मैंने स्टार्ट किया था आई टुक स्लोली स्लोली धीरे धीरे छोटे से पीस से For small dogs, up to 4.5 kg, 33 grams per week. For larger dogs, up to 13 kg, 100 grams. You can give them 100 grams per week. Dogs can have fish, but once or two times per week, but in a small controlled amount. Remember, moderation is the key. Too much can lead to obesity. मैं फिश बच्चों को दो हफ्ते में एक बार देती हूँ उनके डाइट प्लान के साथ. Now, if you don't want to switch to this home prepared diet, or you don't have enough time, then you can always go for commercial dog food. I personally use Purina and Taste of Wild. So these are my favorite, but I'm not promoting any brand. This is not a promotional video. It's just my kids love the flavor, they love the taste, and so these are my two favorite brands. Okay, now some important points. Whenever you buy any packet food, just look for AAFCO label on the packet, which indicates that the diet is complete and balanced diet. Point two: If you want to control or manage your kid's weight, then you must definitely introduce fish to their diet, as they contain healthy fats, but in moderation. Too much can lead to obesity also. ऐसे तो आप फिश कभी भी दे सकते हो. But giving it in the breakfast, try giving it in the evening meal. As fish has an excellent source of melatonin, a hormone जो अच्छी नींद, a good sleep के लिए important है. So that's going to wrap it up for today's video. And if you have enjoyed the video and learned something, then please give that love tap there and subscribe to our channel. And with that said, I'll see you guys in the next video. Till then, bye. Take care.